So this is an Atari Flashback 3 with a Raspberry Pi in it. Uh, it's all modified to be really cool. So I'm going to press the power button and we'll get things started. And it's hooked up via HDMI to this monitor here. And we're going to play some Atari games after it takes a year to boot. Oh, that took an awful long time. So how long did it take for you to do all this? Too long. Um, a couple months. Yeah. What kind of skills <laughs> is required for this? No, nunchuck skills. <laughs> Computer hacking skills. Oh yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. Excellent. Yeah, so <laughs> what expi what inspired you to do this? I, the love for games. You know, all this can be edited out. <laughs> <laughs> it's so awkward. Anyways, so here's the um Stella running. And uh first player can move up and down, so go to ROMs, um, second from, third from the bottom, and press the button, and it goes in, takes a bit <laughs> when it first boots up, and go to Atari, and yeah, hit Space Invaders, and we'll play some Space Invaders, but we have to select the game mode from these buttons. So, if I go to game mode 33, <laughs> for whatever reason, that's the mode I gotta go to, to do two player. So we're at game mode 33, I press start, and we start a two player game. So m my guy's on the right, and there's, and hers is on the left. And you can only have one bullet on the screen at a time because that's the space invaders for you. I can change the difficulty of either player. Oh, I died. If you don't die. <laughs> at any time by pressing the difficulty button. Yes, <laughs> it makes you giant. It's, and I died. Oh, and our lives are shared, which is, you know, a great feature of any game. Truly communist. So, <laughs> yes. A communist decision by Atari. <laughs> Get him! Get him, Alex! Yeah! So as you can see, the right player is better than the left player. Excuse me? <laughs> Um, and we should be good. <laughs>